Hello again, it's Lock Noob, and um, I picked up this Yale out of curiosity, really, because it just was really odd having this um, closed shackle or this shrouded shackle um, on it. It's um, a Y22152, um, and it's got a security rating or strength rating, not security actually, strength rating of 5. So um, I, I assume this is um, a weatherproof padlock. Um, it's got a ball bearing mechanism, so anti-shim, and it's I don't know what that really means. It's uh, it's it's like landing on ground that picture. So I'm assuming it's telling you that it's a uh, quite tough or well made. Um, they say that it's a um, close shackle double ball locking mechanism for increased security, but that's that's really about it. So it doesn't give you. Um, you know, much in the way of uh, information. Nevertheless, let's try and pick it out the pack. Um, as of the pack picking, if you're ever going to try it, um, I would recommend having your full kit on hand, um, but also laying out your favourite picks. I know that you know with, I can get into eighty to ninety percent of any lock with uh, uh, these uh, my favourite picks, mostly because I'm just used to the way they feel and handle. So I've got my Peterson's Gem Sparrow Short Hook. A couple of um, a Southord slimmed tension wrench, um, a rounded um, L wrench, and a, and a Southord Max pick. So um, I can't stand these blister packs. Um, I just I'm sure there's like some really clever way to get into them so easily. But uh, if you know of one, just let me know. I'm assuming, of course, this is just going to let me slide the lock out now. Don't need any keys. There we go. Right. So let's have a look at this. Okay, this is nice. Um, I've seen some Yales with shadow shackles that aren't metal, but I believe that um, that this is. It's a quite a quite a heavy uh, lock actually. Uh, let's have a look inside there. So we've got a sort of standard Yale keyway. Um, I'll try and root out the keys in a minute if I can get into the lock. Uh, quite small, um, so maybe not quite the full size Euro Yale keyway. Tension is going to be hard because you've got quite a big lip there, I'd say about eight millimeters down, so tension might be difficult. Um, that shackle feels very solid in there. Um, okay, let's see what we can do. So let's try this saddle slim down version first. Might slip round. Let's try a big version. Now let's go back. Okay. Hmm. Tensioning this might be difficult just because of the the depth that you have to get down to tension it. I could try doing top of the keyway. See if we've got anything deep enough to get into it that way. So far, actually, um, quite good security features. So let's try a that was my thinnest Mad Bob, and that won't fit in. Okay, let's go down the list and see what I've got. So. Can I get this into tension it? Not really. Wow, this is going to be actually quite hard to tension. Uh, another tension wrench. Ah, okay, so I've got tension on it. Just. Uh, okay, so let's have a go at picking this then. Always start at the back, for me anyway. Don't have to. Nothing. I think it's a five pin. Nothing. Three. Two. This is getting in the way. Do you know what? It's actually quite a good lock in that regard. It's, it actually makes it not easy to pick. Let's try again. Right. On pin three. Two, one, okay, back to the back again. 
Um, I think we're in a full set. Five, four. Three. And we're open. Okay, there we go. So, um, interesting lock this one, actually. I, I'd say that, you know, you, you'd be very hard pushed to shim this. Um, it seems quite well made. It wasn't the easiest pick, but mostly because, as you saw, finding the right uh, way to tension it is hard. I suppose if you could remove this plastic, it would make it a bit easier. But overall, um, yeah, I, I rate this reasonably well. I'd say, it's, it's a, you know, it's a, a good, solid five security, you know, all round, I'd say. Um, you know, perfectly good for um, a medium security application, I'd say. So there we go. That's a Yale uh y22152 picked out of the pack now let's just uh, find the keys um I've left them trapped in here so <laughs> didn't think this one through did i hold on there we go it comes with three keys always nice um can i close it back up yeah close snaps back shut and yeah it opens nice and smoothly yeah i quite like this lock actually and I can see myself using this. Um, okay, see you next time.